imagine five it. Minutes <laughs> so our team name is Tweety's Crib. We worked with the Rice OEDK to build a brooder box for the zoo. So essentially what that means is we made a box that serves as like an incubator for their special birds that need to be raised by hand by the zookeepers. Well, the great thing about this is how self-contained it is. Um, you can pick it up, take it. You know, the birds go home with us at first when, they're, when they need to be fed all night long. So um, we have this great adapter that allows us to plug it into the cigarette lighter, uh, you know, the electrical outlet in a car. Um, so the whole thing is self-contained. The bird, the heater, the fan, everything in one piece. Plug it in the car to keep it warm. Plug it in when you get home so we can transport it back and forth easily. We actually had one of their old brooder boxes with us while we were making this. Things that we added to it is the fact that it's reproducible and all of our parts are bought online. So you can take a, one piece out of any part of it and you can replace it with something that you buy online. It's not difficult to repair and it's only about $250 total to build a new one. So that's mainly what we wanted out of the box. Another thing that we added to it is the removable um, monitor that you can take with you and the alarm is actually on this monitor. So if it's late at night, you can take this um, into your room with you if you leave the brooder box in another room. The alarm goes off because the temperature is too high or the humidity is too low and um, the alarm goes off in your room. It's not waking up the bird, but it alarms you to something going on within the box. And then we also have this interface, which is more convenient than the old interface because it has an up and down button, which is maybe something some people take for granted, but the old box, you just had to keep going up, up, up until you got back to the same temperature. So this was a really nice interface that we found online that we really liked. And lastly, the thing that we added that was the biggest request from the zoo was the wrapping coil around the side so that they weren't messing with the wire and didn't have to leave it, uh, throw it in the box or willy-nilly, it's just easily attached on the side. When we saw when we delivered our final product, when we saw the bird that was going to go into our box that we had just finished making, like that changed everything. That made it feel so real. That made it feel like completely worth everything, all the work that we did. And it felt just amazing. Like to be just a freshman being able to do this incredible thing that's actually going to change the lives of some birds and end up, you know, working with the zoo, an incredible place um, that I've always, I visited a lot as a kid. It's just really cool to have, you know, this experience that paid off.